my name is Amber and this is my bookshelf tour. So I did one of these about a year ago, so I will have that linked down below if you'd like to go see that. But I am currently in the process of moving, so my books are going to have to come off my shelf and be packed up and move to our new place. And so I decided to take this time, just film a bookshelf tour and go through how my shelves look right now. So let's get started with the chaotic bookshelf tour. Okay, up at the very, very, very top is just a small little twilight kind of collection thing that I have here. I have a box set that I didn't want to have on the actual shelves, so I put it up here along with a couple of twilight jewelry and little twilight pop figures. And this little replica ring from her engagement ring, the little ring with the crust on it. This is just a bracelet that Rosalie wore in the films. I have Edward's cuff as well. I also have Rosalie's necklace and Alice's necklace. Last two items up here are the Edward pop figure and the Bella pop figure. Okay, starting on the shelf of the books that I've read, we have Heartless by Marissa Meyer, A Court of Thorns and Roses, and A Court of Mist and Fury, both by Sarah J. Maas. On my copy of Akatar is just this little tiny bookmark from Happy Hello Art. Next I have The Assassin's Blade, Throne of Glass, Crown of Midnight, Air of Fire, Queen of Shadows, and Empire Storms, all by Sarah J. Maas. Carval by Stephanie Garber, Landline by Rainbow Rowell, Red Queen, Glass Sword, and King's Cage, all by Victoria Aveyard. The Crown's Game by Evelyn Skye, Illuminae, and Gemina by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. And lastly on the shelf is the Twilight Special 10th Anniversary Edition with Life and Death by Stephanie Meyer. And now on to the second shelf, Stalking Draft the Ripper by Carrie Maniscalco, The Last of the Fire Drakes by Farrah Umerboy, Wires and Nerve by Marissa Meyer, Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse, Breaking Dawn, and The Short Second Life of Brie Tanner all by Stephanie Meyer. Ferris, Cinder, Garlet, Cress, Winter, and Stars Above all by Marissa Meyer. The Selection, The Elite, The One, Happily Ever After, The Air, the Crown, and The Siren, all by Kira Kath. And lastly, My True Love Gave to Me. And now on to the third shelf, Summer Days and Summer Nights, Girl Against the Universe by Paula Stoke, Carry On, Fangirl, and Eleanor and Park, all by Rainbow Rowell. To All the Boys I Loved Before and P.S. I Still Love You by Jenny Han, The Mark Girl by Lindsay Klingle, The Stars Never Rise and The Flame Never Dies by Rachel Vincent, Hush Hush, Crescendo, Silence, Finale, Dangerous Lies, and Black Ice, all by Becca Fitzpatrick. Illusions of Fate by Kirsten White, The Forgetting by Sharon Cameron, Everland by Wendy Spinal, The Shadow Queen by CJ Redwine, A Fire and Stars by Audrey Colhurst, Roseblood by A.G. Howard, Ever the Hunted by Aaron Summerill, Frostblood by Ellie Blake, Ruined by Amy Tintera, Stealing Snow by Daniel Page, Cruel Beauty and Crimson Bound, both by Rosamund Hodge. And now the next shelf, Passenger by Alexander Bracken, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland and Through the Looking Glass by Lewis Carroll, Forget Tomorrow and Remember Yesterday, both by Pintip Dunn, Cashmere by Temple West, Halo, Hades, and Heaven, all by Alexandra Adonetto, The House by Christina Lauren, Fallen, Torment, Passion, and Rapture, all by Lauren Kate, Angel Fall, World After, and End of Days, all by Susan E. Stitching Snow by R.C. Lewis, The Importance of Being Earnest by Oscar Wilde, Between the Lines and Off the Page by Jody Colt and Samantha Van Leer, Velvet by Temple West, Twilight by Stephanie Meyer, Let It Snow by John Green, Maureen Johnson, and Lauren Miracle, Infinity by Jessica Cardo, The Book of Ivy and The Revolution of Ivy, both by Amy Engel, The Raven Boys by Maggie Steve Otter, A Kiss in Time by Alex Flynn, and Reboot and Rebel by Amy Tintira. And the last final few before we get on to more miscellaneous shelves, Carry of the Mark by Lee Fallon, Shatter Me, Unravel Me, and Ignite Me all by Tahira Moffey. Attachments by Rainbow Rowell, Ready Player One by Ernest Cline, City of Ashes, City of Fallen Angels, City of Lost Souls, and City of Heavenly Fire, all by Cassandra Clare. Kiss by an Angel by Elizabeth Chandler. And these last two are arcs. First, I have an arc of Frost by M.P. Kozlowski. And finally, an arc of Frostblood by Ellie Blake. And lastly are a few miscellaneous items. First, I have the Throne of Glass coloring book, the Little Chronicles coloring book, and the Selection coloring book. Then I have this Throne of Glass notebook, random stickers and decals, carvable pencil holder, and lastly on the shelf are just a few buttons and keychains and necklaces. And this is my Harry Potter shelf. First I have the illustrated edition of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, the illustrated edition of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Then down here I have just this little random pocket watch that has the Deathly Hollows on it. Next I have my two wands on the shelf. This was handmade from a wedding that my husband and I did photography for and this is the Hermione wand from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Then I have the UK box set. Next I have this little island here which my husband got for me. Next I 
have the Fantastic Beast screenplay as well as Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. And lastly are all the little pop figures I have, my Fred and George pop figures, my Dementor pop figure, and lastly I have my Dumbledore pop figure, my Newt Scamander pop figure, and my Hagrid pop figure. And down here I am not going to individually say all these because most of them are my husband's, but I do have this little frame right here which is from The Hundred Lies of Lizzie Lovett. And finally the last shelf, I have all of these as my TBR, that is why they have little green dots on them. The Graces by Laura Eve. The Hundred Lies of Lizzie Lovett by Chelsea Sidoti. The Unexpected Everything by Morgan Matson. Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom, both by Lee Bardugo. Truth Witch by Susan Dinner. The Star Touched Queen by Roshani Chopsky. The Bone Season by Samantha Shannon. Armada by Ernest Klein, The Diabolic by S.J. Kincaid, Yes Please by Amy Poehler, Fallen Kingdom, Rebel Spring, Gathering Darkness, and A Book of Spirits and Thieves, all by Morgan Rhodes, The Darkest Part of the Forest by Holly Black, The Looking Glass Wars, Arch Enemy, and Seeing Red, all by Frank Bador, And I Darken by Kirsten White, An Ember in the Ashes, and A Torch Against the Night, both by Sabah Tahir, Lady Midnight by Cassandra Clare, and finally Slasher Girls and Monster Boys, Never Night by Jay Kristoff, Iron Cast by Destiny Soria, Bright Smoke Cold Fire by Roseman Hodge, The Orphan Queen by Jody Meadows, A Shadow Bright and Burning by Jessica Clues, Assassin's Heart by Sarah Ahers, Wolf by Wolf by Ryan Grodden, The Wrath and the Dawn by Renee Adier, Ash and Bramble by Sarah Primus, A Million Worlds with You by Claudia Gray, Replica by Lauren Oliver, Undertow and Raging Sea both by Michael Buckley, Ruby Red, Sapphire Blue, and Emerald Green all by Kirsten Gear, The Hunger Game, Catching Fire, and Mockingjay all by Susan Collins, Walk on Earth the Stranger by Ray Carson, Nemesis by Anna Banks, Unhooked by Lisa Maxwell, Black Hearts by Nicole Casterman, The Winner's Curse, The Winner's Crime, and The Winner's Kiss all by Marie Rutowski. Three Dark Crowns by Kindar Blake, Labyrinth Lost by Zoraida Cordova, Alive by Scott Sigler, The Rest of Us Just Live Here by Patrick Ness, Library of Souls by Ransom Riggs, Rebel Veil by Rachel Hawkins, Between the Devil and the Deep Blue Sea by April Genevieve Chikolk, Lost Stars by Claudia Gray, Compulsion by Martina Boone, The Scorpion Rules by Aaron Bell, Anna and the French Kiss, Lola and the Boy Next Door, and Isla and the Happily Ever After, all by Stephanie Perkins, Frostfire and Ice Kiss, both by Amanda Hawking, These Broken Stars by Amy Kaufman and Megan Spooner, Far Far Away by Tom McNeil, Splintered by A.G. Howard, Trial by Fire by Josephine Angelini, Upgraded by Naomi Novik, The Kiss of Deception by Mary E. Pearson, The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer, The Evolution of Mara Dyer, and The Retribution of Mara Dyer, all by Michelle Hodkin, Shadow and Bone and Siege and Storm, both by Leigh Bardugo, The Darkest Minds and Never Fade, both by Alexander Bracken, Alice in Zombieland and Through the Zombie Glass, both by Gina Showalter, Into the Dim by Janet B. Taylor, Our Darker Shade of Magic by B.E. Schwab, Paranormalcy, Supernaturally, and Endlessly, all by Kirsten in white, Black City in Phoenix, both by Elizabeth Richard, Clockwork Angel, Clockwork Prince, and Clockwork Princess, all by Cassandra Clare, The Forest of Hands and Teeth by Carrie Ryan, The Diviners by Libba Bray, Strange Angels and Portrayals by Lily St. Crow, Across the Universe by Beth Revis, Dune by Casey Corp and Laurie Langdon, Sweet Evil by Wendy Higgins, Dorothy Must Die by Daniel Page, The Burning Sky by Sherry Thomas, A Thousand Pieces of You by Claudia Gray, Blue Lily Lily Blue and Dream Thieves, both by Maggie Steve Honor, Soul Screamers by Rachel Vincent, Lux Beginnings, Lux Consequences, and Lux Opposition, all by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Mistborn by Brandon Sanderson, The Immortal Rules by Julie Kagawa, Wildfire by Karsten Knight, Angel Fire by L.A. Weatherly, Eerie by C.M. McCoy, Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor, and lastly are all the arcs on the show. First I have Given to the Sea by Mindy McGinnis, Spare and Found Parts by Sarah Maria Griffin, Vengeance Road by Aaron Bauman, The Witch Hunter by Virginia Bowecker, A Wicked Thing by Rihanna Thomas, Alive by Chandler Baker, The Accident Season by Moria Foley Dole, Origin by Jessica Cole, and lastly, Win Witch by Susan Denner. Okay, these next two shelves are my husband's shelves, though they're mostly his books, but I will go through them. The first few things that are on here are mine though, and this is a little In Front of Vices ring. And next I just have random TBR jars and a jar that holds random bookmarks. First we have A Knight of the Seven Kingdoms, A Clash of Kings, A Storm of Swords, A Dance with Dragons, all by George R. R. Martin, The Ultimate Hitchhiker's Guide by Douglas Adams, Gumption by Nick Offerman, Console Wars by Blake J. Harris, The Fault in Our Stars, Will Grayson Rule Grayson by John Green, Shadows of the Empire by Steve Perry, Dad is Fat, and Food, A Love Story, both by Jim Gaskin. Next we have a Song and Ice and Fire collection, and the illustrated edition of Game of Thrones. The illustrated editions of The Two Towers and The Return of the King, the annotated edition of The Hobbit, The Hobbit, Unfinished Tales, Fellowship of the Ring, The Lord of the Rings, The Children of Hurin, The Legend of Sigurd and Gundren, The Silmarillion, The Silmarillion, The Story of Kalurva, all by J.R.R. Tolkien, The Time Traveler's Almanac, The Chronicles of Narnia, oh. That Hideous Strength, Out of the Silent Planet, all by C.S. Lewis, 1984 by George Orwell, 
And down here is <laughs> is just a bunch of random miscellaneous things as well. That is all the books that are on my shelf. Do plan on having a bookshelf reorganization tour because I have a new shelf and everything is going to be redone and reorganized in my new place. So I will have a video for that up eventually, hopefully maybe next month if possible. So stay tuned for that and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Velvet by Temple West. Really?